live at the Garden Theater. Down on Wilbur Box, the Garden Theater, not Garden Bowl. I know a lot of people in the wrong place. Garden Theater, man. In fact, BBW, man. Beers, man. Whiskey, man. Man. It's your boy Q Lewis. Hold it down live from the place of my number man, Andrew Crystal, in the building. And now we got, uh, we got another special guest in the building. Now I'm allowed to introduce myself to him. Where are you from, though? I'm um, from Grand Ben Harbor, Calabasso, and Grand Rapids. My name is Daryl Reese. The owner of Stock the Bar Stock the Bar. Yeah. So how long, how long have you just been? Since 2019. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, man. Okay, so is this something that you started because of the pandemic? Yeah. I it, started, it, started, it started right before the pandemic. Yeah. I have to ask you, whatever people started. No, it started 2019, December 1st. Oh, okay. The same day marijuana came legal. <laughs> we started. Then the pandemic hit in about March. Yeah. yeah. So what's he doing? Liquor stuff before nope, this? Nope, I ain't did nothing. So no liquor ever. Well, I used to. I thought I used to have events in my basement. Okay. Everybody brought a fit the liquor to stock my bar with. Hold on, wait a minute. Wait yeah, a minute. yeah. So your company started from yeah. the basement. Yeah, party. yeah. Thirty people. Yeah. yeah. Now I have a party every year with five hundred people from all over the country. That's good yeah, idea. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, man. So yeah. it just turned out good. Yeah. Yeah. About the company, like well, I started doing YouTube videos introducing people to. Michigan made alcohol. And the distillery got in touch with me and said, Would you like to come out with your own bottle? And I said, Don't nobody do that. They said, You can. So I studied for 10 months, learned how to sell and market, and December 1st we came out. Yep, me and my wife. So you've been doing it for a couple of years. What do you think is the most popular Michigan alcohol? Most popular? Yeah. Stop the bar, Bob. What else is he going to say, right? Yeah. I mean, what was the most popular when you came in? Oh, yeah? yeah. We just talking about Michigan Vodka? It wasn't much. There's one here that's called uh, Detroit 8. It got an 8 on it. I did one of their, video, one of their videos. It's something from Detroit, and it got an 8 on it. 8 Mile Vodka. Yeah, so y'all didn't even know about it. I know. So I was putting people on the different Michigan made alcohols. That's so how I got started. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So. So what's, that, what's special about your brand? Well, it's a wheat brand. Everything in it is made in Michigan. Okay. Made by the Grand Rapids and the Lansing area. And we give money back to the Boys and Girls Club of Ben Harbor, Kalamazoo, and Grand Rapids. The three cities I lived in. Yeah, so I definitely got to go throw up my man's name. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, Christopher Wilson, he, work, he works at the Boys and Girls Club. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's big to us. All right, I, yeah, it's big to me. I'm going to have to connect y'all. Yeah, man. please do. Please do. I see, I see there's a connection already. You say it's all Michigan made. Are you all able to trace like down to the farm? Yes, because the weed is made in Lowell, Michigan, which is like 20 minutes outside of Grand Rapids. Okay. Okay. And vodka ain't much, but you know, the wheat or the potato or the corn okay. or the grapes. <laughs> and then water and stuff, you know, and sugar, that's all it is. So the sugar is in Michigan. So it's not a lot of, it's not a lot of variance in, in vodka. Okay. Right. So vodka is vodka is vodka. Right. It depends on how many times it's distilled yeah. to make it that smooth feel. So, how many so, times you all distilled? Six times. Six? Yeah. Okay. So, where did you learn your process at? I learned from the distillery. Okay. They taught me. Yeah. So I had nobody to teach me how to sell alcohol, <laughs> but they taught me how to distill it. Yeah. In Mission Grain Distillery out in Lansing, Michigan. Uh, yeah. Where you go, dog? So, so what's next? I don't know, man. Just conquering Michigan first. <laughs> All I care about Michigan first, then I worry about the world. Sure. Yeah. Worry about the world. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, when? Huh? You thinking about outside of vodka or? Sticking with my Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm thinking about everything. Okay, because you know, we we bourbon and whiskey. Well I was too until I came out with a vodka. So now you're a vodka drinker. <laughs> it's don't people say how you hey, get in the vodka. I mean yeah. people say how you come out with a vodka. Yeah. They don't they the only ones gave me the opportunity. Yeah. So right. you know. Damn, all right. So you, I'm gonna drink the vodka. Though. Yeah, please do. But I do want some bourbon or I'll hook you up okay. and when I make the bourbon you'll be the first one to try it. I, hey look. For real. When you get ready to make it though. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna we go get all your contacts. Yes, please. When you get ready to make it, we want an exclusive interview. Yes! <laughs> That's guaranteed. This is about the first I've ever been in. I ain't right. been in Detroit like that and did no interviews at all. Yeah. So I appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah. We definitely gonna reach out to yeah, you. Yeah, huh? appreciate and it. And tell me where they can find your brand. Like, well, we're where, in o yeah, where is it at right now? Well, we're in, over, yeah, we're in over 40 Meyer in the state. We in Detroit. Yeah, yeah. We in we in all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah we moving. Yeah. We in all four total wine in the state. Total wine. Uh, we in Detroit Airport. 
we on we on Myers on eight mile and eleven ten mile. We on Gracious Ave. Is that the name? We at that liquor store. Yeah, we at that yeah we at that liquor store. Yeah, we in over two hundred stores in the state. Yeah, yeah, liquor basket. Yeah, we in a happy shop. Yeah, we. Twenty nine ninety nine. That's the case. It's a yeah. It's twenty nine ninety nine at the store. Affordable Michigan made vodka. Yes, and it's a premium vodka. Yes, that's right. That's right. How you how you gonna beat that? Right. Yeah. Yeah. So. And he's going to be the only boxer that yeah. we talk about on the Beers, Bourbon, Whiskey podcast. And we got bourbon and whiskey. My God. So well, guess who's going to get the first bourbon from Stock the Bar? Y'all. We got, we that's, right, that's right. <laughs> hey, you got, you got a card on this one? Yeah, I got plenty of them. I got a card. Yeah, yeah, we gonna stop by yeah that's our table right here. Yeah, we gonna talk about y'all. Yeah, that's our table, man. That's, that's my wife and that's my sister and my cousin. This is straight yeah. family on Yeah, family. yeah, all day. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's impressive. We were just talking about that. Yeah. Sure how everybody's able to stay in the liquor business. Yeah. It's profitable and it's yeah. been a long time. Well, you know what, I'm, I'm asking now that you're here because the question I was asking her, uh -huh. I was like, are, are people nervous about the brand that's like last? Because, you know, you look at old brands, you talk about stuff that's been generations. Yeah. All stuff is kind of just start. Like, yeah. are, are you afraid that it's not going to last through the generations? I'm not. Uh, because liquor is going to sell. For, sure for one. Sell. But for sure. you got to be out there. I didn't have to grab in the snow to come here, but I had to. Exactly. I've been to, I used to go to six cities in one day. Oh, yeah. 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 Because I, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I got to, no doubt. you know, so, yeah. because what we do is going to help other people. Sure. It might not be way. directly, but it's going to help others. Now, if I come to Grand Rapids to visit, do you all have a distillery? Do you have the a distillery is in Lansing. Okay. So it's a distillery. We're working on the distillery in Grand Rapids okay. now. Because okay. I own a barber and beauty salon. Okay. That's what, so we got a building of our own, so we're working about all that, but it's just new. Yeah. What's the uh, shout out to uh, Barber and Beauty Slime? House of Style Barber and Beauty We've been in the business since 1959. My father in law owned it, yeah. Okay. And my wife been on it since 20 years uh, now. That's what we do. And I cut in. Thank you. No, it's a pleasure. Yes, please do, man. If I get some tickets, I'll make sure y'all get it so y'all drink off of it. Okay. Okay. And we're going to review it today. No, I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Oh, you gonna like it. And tell the people again where they can find your social media. Uh, everything Stock the Bar. Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, Stock the Bar Baca. That's me, Daryl Reese, my wife, Deborah Reese. What's up, bro? My dog. Thank you. Hey, thank you, man. Thank you, man. Appreciate y'all, bro. Thank you, man. Thank you, man. I appreciate y'all. I'm gonna get y'all something to Baca, though. Yeah, we gonna get some video. Stock the Bar Baca, man. Check out my dog. Yeah. 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 Yeah.